Hey guys, what is up? My name is DBC Devo or the Theo Fan Gamer, and welcome to a tutorial video of Dragon Block C 1.6.2. The new Minecraft installer comes with new problems, and I have encountered one of those problems with actually my Java. So I would, uh, if you guys want to stay tuned for that, and I'll put that at the end of the video, and I'll explain my problem and everything. So the first thing you need to do to install this mod is first, of course, go to the place where it's, you can install the mod. So I, the link in the description of the Minecraft forum for Dragon Block C. You go, you, it starts you from all the way from the top, from all the way to the top, and you gotta scroll all the way down to this part right here. Not all the way down, but it gives you a table of contents. You go downloads for 1.6.2, and you download the first, the third, and the fourth. The fourth is an optional thing to make it kind of. For, it, this is required for like you know, better saying hair. So I just let it right there, and it's actually makes it look better and you know you have better hair and you can actually have the hairstyles and everything so if you want to have the hairstyles and everything you can download if you want to if you don't it's fine um so click so as soon as you download all three of these files well actually it's only the first second to the fourth whoops these these two this sorry if i missed you mess up right now um i after you download all three of them i downloaded them already so it's all the ad fly you can just go through it and everything so i downloaded it, this one right here so these are the three things that you need so the first thing before you do anything, the first thing is click on this one, double click this one, and this should pop up. The Minecraft Forge installer. There's an auto installer, so all you have to do is hit OK and you should be fine. So I make sure it's on client, it's a single player, and I'm not doing a server I'm not doing a server installation. So there you just hit OK and this should pop up. It says wait, install the client profile forge for version forge nine ten zero seven eight nine into an into a launcher. So as soon as you got that done, you wanna hit um, you wanna hit Damn it! I don't remember, I remember the button. Windows button and R. Then you hit percent. You put in percent app data. Hit OK. Then you go to Minecraft. Minecraft. Then you go to versions. And if this pops up right here, I think it, it might be just this, or it might be this too. But I think it's just gonna be this whole thing right here, since it's kind of new and everything. So this should pop up. And when this pops up, you ins install it successfully. And as soon as you do that, you want to actually run your Minecraft. Because if you don't run it, you don't have uh, this one right here. Wait, whoops. You don't have the mods folder. The mods folder is not installed. I ran it before, so that's why it's in there. You can make a mods folder, but just in case, I'd rather have, um, I'd rather actually run Minecraft once to see if it actually is working in condition and everything instead of making my mods folder and putting on the mods because maybe messing up or whatever. So you want to hit on your Minecraft, you hit run. After that, you go to your, you edit your profile. So make sure you're signed in and everything, you edit your profile and make sure it's actually on the Forge, the new Forge one that you just installed. So click that. This is this is for future, you know, if you're in the future and you're watching this, you know, hello from the future. Uh, it'll, whatever mod or whatever launcher or whatever release it's at, uh, you should have it there and as soon as you do it, you hit save profile, you hit play. And after you do that, you should get something if my Minecraft wants to pop up any second now. There you go. There you go, Minecraft. So I have this picture back because it's awesome. Um, as soon as you hit that, you should have the three mods loaded and three mods active. So as you go into mods, you should see these three mods. If you got that, you're doing great so far. And the next part, the next part should be freaking easy. Go into your mods, hit the folder or whatever place you have the two full, the two WinRAR files. You just highlight them both, drag and drop. Easy. You're done installing the mod. All you gotta do is hit Minecraft again run and you still have to have forge because stuff so for because uh, forge actually works with the mod folder so as soon as you do that you just hit play you should have the mods they make sure the forge is on there the forge the latest forge file when you just downloaded because if you don't have that then it wouldn't run the mods so as soon as you got that done it takes a little bit longer because for some reason the they actually because since dragon blocks you so big and so gigantic it runs on like an internal server so as soon as you exit the game you'll see shutting off the internal server so it's a big game so it makes it awesome so as soon as you got that you have five mods and you should have the two mods at the bottom right here and you are done so you want to make sure that it's actually it actually does work i'll go into my new world that i did cheat in so the saying right there cheated it's a cheater i don't know new world so you should be installed in here i already had some i did some tests over there so you should see that all the chakras or chakras <laughs> Avatar recently. Avatar the last 
Airbender in. I was watching. I was watching the episode with the, the old guy, with the old uh, guy teaching about the chakras, and it was like unlock all the chakras. Sorry, but uh, you should have it all fine, and you should be all dandy. And I believe I don't know where Kami's lookout was. Kami's lookout was here somewhere because I recently died. So you can choose what attacks you want. Um, I shall choose. I'll practice one right now, do one right now. A destructive disc. Let's see the destructive disc. So to do them, you just have to go left. Right. Right. How much is it? Thank you, yeah. Yeah, I'm doing it right, right? Oh, for some reason I can't do it. Okay. <laughs> This mod a lot. If you guys want to see me playing the dang game, I will do a series later in about maybe about a few days on the actual mod, and I will have lots of fun. And hope you guys can join me and everything. So the mod, the, the problem that I encountered with this file right here, I could not run it as a jar file, and this is what it popped up. Let me just bring the file up here. I did take snapshots with uh, with my fraps, so um, it's not in movies. It's on screenshot. See, I took a. I took quite a few, few okay, why did this always do this when it does this? Okay, I took quite a few, so I took the one that's the darkest and you can see it. Um, right here, this is the, the problem that I encountered. This is right here. Could not find or load main class, and it had my user, my name, and blah, 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 blah. For some reason, this happens. Um, I don't know why. My, I installed my Java like a few months ago, six months ago, and this problem came up or something like that. So the easiest thing to do it is the most simplest and one one of computers is to uninstall Java and reinst just reinstall it. That's all you have to do. Uninstall and then download it again. That's what I did. It was perfectly fine. Maybe uninstall everything. That includes the update and that includes Java. So I had two of them, the Java update and then the actual uh, Java itself. So uninstall both of them, go into Java website, reinstall it, and you should be fine. You should run it. I know I, I want to say this problem because I had this problem and I know a lot of people on the internet that wanted clarification on the problem. Um, do the same thing and I and there's actually a better there's actually a, a different way of doing it but it's like a really in-depth you have to change codes around stuff like that so the easiest thing I did was delete uh, install again easy easy as pie so that's the problem that I encountered hopefully you guys had help during this video hope I didn't babble too much hope you guys got the damn you know shit down so thank you guys for watching hope you guys have a wonderful time and we'll hope this helped out a lot and I will see you guys later please subscribe if you want to not fashion YouTube if you want to subscribe you can subscribe like the video if you did like it comment if you want have any questions for me or if you just want to say thank you yeah. uh, I'll see you guys later peace